had all this information given to us. And then meanwhile, because I was progressing quickly, I got thrown into the performing group that Arthur had. And um, I, first of all, was in group pieces that you saw the pictures of. And then after that, uh, I started to get all principal parts. And he had uh, different people who would come in and partner me. So it was very interesting experience. And I was lucky because somebody liked me and I was able to do a good deal of work. And then I worked with Matt Maddox. One time he was putting on a performance at, uh, I think it was at the uh, Hilton um, for a group of some fashion people or whatever. Anyway, we did a jazz thing. So um, I was in that group. And then I worked with Luigi for a while, who was also, uh, at that point, Luigi and Matt Maddox were like the big gurus of jazz. And a lot of the companies at that point were really in bad shape anyway, because you would have like eight weeks of performance, and then you'd be off for two months. So, you know, people would be slinging hash in between because they were with these companies that didn't have long seasons and didn't have good salaries and were not union at that point, the whole nine yards. I was lucky because I didn't have to swing hash because I could sing. So I went to the Bell Tavern and auditioned and I sat on the piano in my red dress in my heels and sang for a half hour and then walked around and said hello to the customers and then did the can-can at the end with the, the girls who were in the, the dancing part of the show. So I got a job at Shrapps it was nine to closing, which was the after theater. And who comes in but Ed Sullivan? And I recognized him, and he got on my table. So I was very, you know, happy to see him. And I said, "Gee, I watch your show a lot." And he said, "And what did you think of this last show?" And then there were some things on it that I really liked. And they said, "You know, this show, this was good, and this was good, and this, but that other thing, why did you have that on there?" So every week when he was finished with his filming, he would come in and he asked to sit on my table. But he'd always say, how did you like the show? And I'd tell him exactly what I thought. And I think that's what he liked is that, you know, I didn't, I wasn't like, oh, Mr. Sullivan, oh my God, you know, I wasn't like that. I was just saying what I thought and uh, he was really, really nice, so I, I always made a lot of money when I waited on his table because he'd leave $20 bill. I mean, the bill was never $20, but he'd leave $20 bill.